most genes that affect fertility are often known as recessive genes. Uh, and this, this means you generally need to have inherited two bad copies of a particular sperm or ovum gene before you experience infertility. Uh, so, such mutations or, or variations are often present uh, in both your mother's and your father's side of the family. Uh, but these family members will be unaffected uh, as they possess one good and one bad copy of the gene, which is enough to have a normal fertility phenotype. It's only if you have the two bad ones together you get the bad, bad uh, phenotype. Uh, occasionally, however, you might inherit one bad copy of a variant form of a gene that is present in several individuals from one side of the family, uh, for say from your, your mother's side. You might also then unfortunately inherit a bad copy of the same genes from your other parents, say your father, uh, where no individuals have a family history of a bad gene. Uh, and, and this mutation is called a new, or in Latin, de novo, or another term, sporadic mutation. You know, it's, it's just occurred in the father's sperm. Yeah, so it's a, uh, uh, it's been taken, yeah, so it's by, uh, and occurred, yeah, so it occurred during development in fertile patients, father's sperm or mother's ovum. Yeah, so it's just in the development of the, the father or mother's sperm or the father or mother's ovum, early on there's been a mut mutation that's not in any of, any other cells of the parent, it's just happened in the in the progenitor cells of, of sperm or ovum. Um, uh, so th this mutation then passed on uh, to present in all the chromosomes of the infertile patient. Uh, so an example of this is the chromosome 15 deletion that I mentioned earlier that causes deafness in male infertility. Uh, in this case, a son may inherit the deletion of the um, on one, one of his chromosome 15s from his unaffected mother. Uh, the other mutated chromosome 15 can be shown not to be present in DNA extracted from his father, father's blood or saliva, it's not present. But why has he got two bad copies of chromosome 15? The only explanation in her is a bad chromosome uh, 15 from the father is that there's been a new or de novo mutation during the father's sperm production. Uh, Unfortunately, the son, he therefore ends up with two mutated chromosome 15s, uh, despite this mutation not being found in any of the father's relatives. Um, such de novo or new mutations are much more likely to occur in older fathers. Uh, as the older the, the sperm-making cells, the more likely that a new mutation is likely to come to ar arise. So, yes, yeah, so you get many more mu genetic mutations the older the father maybe over the age of 40, 50, 60, so on.